I'm Chef Jasper for Hen House Markets. Today, we're gonna make a classic Italian appetizer dish that's simple and delicious and something all the family will enjoy, clams oreganata. This is well known through Italy as an appetizer or as a little first course, something to munch on before dinner time. Now, myself, I really can't help you when it comes to the question, where does the name oreganata come from? And I'm a big food history buff, but I don't know. So if you wanna add a little oregano, go ahead. Fresh or dried, it doesn't matter. My father never added it to it, so I don't today, but who knows, it may taste a little better. Clams oreganata. Now my preference is to use fresh garlic and never get the garlic, place it on a board and hit it with your hand. All that does is release all of the essential oils and the flavoring, the perfume, out of the garlic. So just get your garlic, cut off that little end, discard that, just cut it right down the middle. It'll peel back, very, very simple. Get rid of this right here, and there you have it. And then we're just gonna chop it up. We use four cloves. This is one dish where I will tell you, the more garlic, the better. To that, we will add some chopped Italian parsley. And now we just mix it all together. And really, I don't mind if you have some nice pieces of garlic, little chunks in there. We will mix this with some breadcrumbs in just a few seconds here. So we have our Italian breadcrumb mixture here. We start with the breadcrumbs, some Romano cheese, oregano, it's up to you. Don't look, Dad. We'll add our chopped parsley and garlic. We'll mix this all up. Now, another little hint right here, you may want to add a little bit of olive oil to your breadcrumbs. Kind of makes them a little moist. All right, we have our mixture. Now we get our clams. Fill each clam and don't be shy with the filling. We like that on there. We will get all of these filled up and then we're gonna drizzle a little bit of extra virgin olive oil right on top. Place them under a broiler a few minutes and you have one of the greatest, most famous Italian appetizers. You'll imagine you're back in Italy enjoying some classic clams oreganata on the Amalfi Coast. Just a little bit of oil right on top of each one. And now we'll place this in the oven, put them under the broiler. And now right out of the oven and onto a platter, clams oreganata. Oh, I'll tell you, usually you serve about a dozen to a person, but maybe in trouble, you may get, maybe get a little more. Drizzle on just a little bit of that lemon juice when you're finished. Maybe a little more olive oil, but these are pretty moist. Right on top, just a little of that lemon juice. Oh boy, there you have it. Clams oreganata with or without the oregano, a classic seafood Italian dish that everyone will love. I'm Jasper Mirabli for Hen House Markets. My father always said, eat and drink well. <laughs>